So I've decided to add some horizontal wall mounted brackets for these packout organizers for the side wall of my tool trailer just to keep them up off the stack make them more accessible I found these aluminum ones online and they look far superior to the 3d printed plastic ones at least for what I'm doing I want them to really be durable and strong and they're ungodly expensive I think they were about seventy dollars per pair delivered that's in Canadian dollars but they're really really nice they're shiny like these are really really well made I'm very impressed by that here's a sticker with their logo I'm not getting endorsed or paid by them in any way I just found them online randomly and they're one for each side and it slides up on and then one latch part for the top just figure out how those go how they'd be oriented with the box Unfortunately, they never came with any template or instructions on how to space them, so I'm just going to have to figure that out myself. So I've decided to use an 8 foot long piece of plywood and have four, one, two, three, four boxes evenly spaced out, so dividing that 8 foot sheet into 2 foot pieces. Um, that's the frame of the trailer as well, so the screws will go there and there according to those 24 inch centers and then went and divided those 24 inch centers in half to find the center line of each box. If you're with me on that, so there's 12 inches, I made a mark. And then I didn't really know how high to put them, but I wanted to have a few inches. There's almost six inches of upward travel to grab it and a couple inches on the bottom because they do move up and I wanted that extra space on top when I grab it to slide it up so it doesn't bump into something I might have up on top there. So that seems about right to me. I think that's enough room there. I then determined where the center of those brackets would be. The spacing is 10 inches on center for the screw holes and measured up to find where that um, latch would be using the same reference point from the bottom I measured up and in my case off the bottom edge of the board here I'm three and a half inches to the bottom of that cleat or that boot whatever you call it so in this case it's three and a half for the sides and thirteen and seven eighths roughly for the latch from the edge of the reference to the bottom of the latch and you would just adjust that according to whatever you have for bottom measurement. So mine happens to be three and a half. That's just where I put them. And 10 inch across on center. And of course the latch is on center. I'm going to test fit it, slide it down, click it in. Works really good. I see my helper, Charlie, has come to see me. He's wondering what this noise is with all these nails rattling. And there's a bit of play there. I'm fine with that. I kind of put it in the middle, not too high, not too low. And here they are mounted up in the trailer on the wall. I'm very happy with how strong they are. They really hold these well. You can put a lot of weight on there. And so these are the first two brackets that I bought, the first two sets. They're just one piece and a double sized bin organizer slides on. Whereas these second pairs are made in two pieces with the little feet riveted on. And they've got a little latch on top. So it allows you to put a double size organizer or a single one and it'll latch on on top. Like over here you can hang one of the small ones, one on each side, like this, double it up, or a big one. So I actually like those better than the other ones because they're a little bit more versatile. You could slide singles on these but they won't lock. Overall it was worth the cost. I really like them. They're strong. They get those pack out organizers up off of the stack. It's really nice to have them up and accessible. You can see them. That way you don't have to dig through four or five things trying to get down to these bottom ones. Pulling all them off it just makes a mess. Whereas here I only have to take a couple off to get to those boxes now. It's not so bad.